I'm Stacy Gramazio at Florence Copper, and we are so proud to be sponsors of this year's convocation for the Florence Unified School District. To me, Florence Copper represents opportunity. I've been a resident of Pinal County for over 10 years, living in Santan Valley. Happy to say my two sons go to Skyline Ranch. And I, I love living in Santan Valley and I love working in Florence. Uh, this is a community that needs more opportunities and Florence Copper is able to provide both jobs and economic uplift for the area. So Florence Copper is a unique operation. It's not a, a, a traditional mining as, uh, that you would think about underground mining as well as an open pit mine. And actually, it's a, a, a copper extraction process. So the in-situ process removes copper by taking the copper oxide minerals, chrysocolla primarily, and removing that from the surface of the rock. The host rock is inert to these copper recovery solutions. That means you do not have a hole in the ground or any kind of subsidence. In this case, completely eliminating the dumps, tailings facilities, and other uh, characteristics that are usually associated with conventional mining. This is proven science and technology, and my team has proven experience for decades in this mining industry. It's exciting to think of the opportunity that we have here. We have an opportunity to recover the mineral in an environmentally responsible way that creates economic uplift for both Florence, Santan Valley, Coolidge, all of Pinal County. So this project is predicted to generate $3.4 billion in economic uplift for the state of Arizona. 2.1 billion of that economic activity will remain in Pinal County. I grew up in the Copper Corridor, so I know firsthand how important the mining industry are to families in the area. Both my kids went to Florence High School, and I spent many years as a cheer mom. Go Gophers! This project will require 240 direct and indirect jobs that report to the site. Mother Nature has shattered this war body. So what that does is it allows us to recover copper by using a solution and passing this solution through a series of wells rather than using the traditional open pit and underground mining methods that people are familiar with. So this dramatically shrinks the footprint down to less than 10% of, of what it would be using conventional techniques. So my 30 years of experience uh, both environmentally and into the mining industry itself I've developed a, and assembled a team of professionals on this project that actually uh, have job skills that are unique to this particular uh, project. Uh, we, have, we assemble you know, metallurgists, scientists, uh, hydrologists, and those type of folks, and all these folks that have worked with me for many years. And uh, if you total up a years of experience of all of us, it's over 100 years of experience. The Florence Copper Project um, is a project that I've been with since 2011. And since that time, the project has donated over $200,000 to local community projects in Florence, Santan Valley, and surrounding communities. The Florence Copper Creating Opportunity Scholarship has awarded over $55,000 to local students from the Florence Unified School District. The Florence Copper Community Foundation has awarded over $40,000 to local nonprofits throughout Pinal County. Florence Copper has been and will always be committed to investing in Florence, Santan Valley, and Pinal County. We want to connect educators in the area with real world experiences in hydrology, metallurgy, environmental engineering, things that get kids excited about science and technology uh, because this project really is mining for the 21st century and we know that you are preparing students for the 21st century so um, you're welcome to visit our website to learn more www.florencecopper.com and uh, you know come take a tour get the facts ask the questions and uh, you know you're always welcome here at, at Florence Copper Thank you.